Good morning, everyone. Welcome to our next Star Wars customizable card game set review series. This is a video on the Dagobah set. Uh, we have, this came out after the Hoth expansion. There were 180 cards in this set. It was also printed in 1996 and it was only printed in English. So if you are a Star Wars collector, set collector, um, you'll need all 180 cards in this set. They were printed in nine card expansion packs. Um, so this box had like 60 packs in it because they were all nine cards. And they also had supplemental rules to explain a lot of the new characters and mechanics in this set. Um, I probably won't go into detail reading all of these. If you have questions, uh, let me know. I can check and answer those in the comments. But basically there's some, um, there's asteroid fields, there are some asteroid rules. Um, wherever asteroid rules are in effect, your starships are continually subject to being hit by asteroids during each of your control phases for each such starship. Uh, there are vehicle and starship capacities and some starship sites changes and Yoda um, Notice you will on my card a new icon there is yes Jedi master it means and a light side force icon it includes while on table am I one extra force may you activate so we'll have to check that out on the Yoda card. There are also uh, the set list printed on the back of the supplemental rule sheet for anyone that wanted to collect the set like we did. I just kept that in that box. I also did a little research on the set. I didn't find any misprints or any special um, things to note. So we just basically are going to look at 180 cards. Uh, I'm guessing there's going to be 90 light side cards here. And these are the light side cards. Very nice. They're all packed fresh. So like really minty look like super minty, like just came right out of the booster box. And we have a rule book and the dark side. So I'm guessing there's gonna be 90 light side, 90 dark side, probably something like 60 rares, 60 uncommons, and 60 commons. These are the, the dark side cards from Dagobah. You can see the dark side there. So we'll just go through these like we did the other sets, and you can kind of see what some of the rare cards are, see what all the cards are, but also see what like the key chase cards that you might need to complete the set. So <clears throat> Dagobah, nothing too special crazy in here, although I do think Yoda is probably the best card in the set. Um, we have Anoat. Here's the asteroid field that they talked about in the rules. There's a big one, there's a big asteroid. Uh, some cave spaces, there's Dagobah. More, there's a jungle. Yeah, some of this art is just beautiful on here. Then we have um, Son of Skywalker. So we have a young Luke Skywalker, power five, ability five. There's the Yoda card that we were looking for. Let's do, that's our thumbnail right there. Uh, power two, ability seven, Jedi Master. And then this is the Jedi Master symbol. So we have you know, this one rebel character, one Jedi master, and then we have some, some aliens. Bogwing, Minoc, Nudge, Space Slug, Vine Snake, a Jedi strength. So we have these Jedi test cards, which are new in Dagobah. There's Jedi strength test number two. Actually, let's do this. Let's do, put our, Bases here. Let's put Yoda, Yoda there. Jedi strength, domain of evil, great warrior, 
it is the future you see size matters, not astromech translator, droid sensor scope, some devices, Han's toolkit, landing claw, Luke's backpack, portable fusion generator, rebel flight suit, retractable arm, anger, fear, aggression, asteroids do not concern me, asteroid sanctuary at peace, Descent into the dark, or do or do not. There is no try. Okay, never tell me the odds. Obi-Wan's apparition. So yeah, he appears in Dagobah. We'll put that like that. Move these up. Uh, there's Obi-Wan, a younger Polarized negative power coupling. There's quite a few effects in this set. Quick draw, reflection, report to Lord Vader, rogue asteroid, Riker's run, scramble, smuggler's blues, stone pile. Luke tries to put those together using the force. These cards are really shiny, slick, and nice condition. Wars make not make one great. What's that bidding the master? Yoga's gimmer stick. Yoda's Hope. Away, put your weapons closer, control. Egregious pilot error. Found someone you have. I have a bad feeling about this when Leia goes on the Jedi Levitation. Levitation, light maneuvers, lost relay. Moving to attack position, recoil and fear, shoo shoo. Starship levitation. So yeah, a lot of levitation, a lot of cave things. This card's kind of cool. It is, uh, I'll put this right here. It is an upside down card. So when Luke, when Luke stands upside, does a handstand upside down, it's a lost interrupt. And so at the end of any player's draw phase, cause that player to place used pile face up on top of the reserve deck Shuffle, cut, and replace. When face-up cards are removed from reverse deck, reserve deck, they are treated as normal, no longer remain face-up. So yeah, that's pretty cool. That's my favorite card so far from the Dagobah set. Um, you have Visored Vision. We can still outmaneuver them. We don't need these scum. Wahoo! When R2 gets launched. Yoda Stew, that looks gross delicious maybe yoda you seek yoda and you do have your moments this is, all right so let's move on to the dark side cards those are all light side cards from dagobah these are the dark size there's another anoat asteroid fields big one asteroids executor control um Death Star Destroyer, Launch Bay, Captain Nita, Com Chief, Commander Brandi, Commander Gerant, Commander Nemet, Corporal Durdram, Corporal Vandalay, Imperial Helmsman, Lieutenant Commander Arden, Lieutenant Suba, Lieutenant Venka, and Warrant Officer MK. So yeah, a lot of Imperial officers, Bosk, Dengar, Zookus, Forlom, IG-88, Bogwing, Dragon Snake, Minoc, Sleen, Space Slug, Vine Snake. Those are the mission locations. We have some starships. We have Avenger. And an Avenger foil appears. That's kind of cool. Um, what's that one from? Does anybody know what the foil is from? Does it come, did Dagobah come with some foil cards? I'm not, I don't recall. I'll have to do some research on that, but that's the Avenger foil. That's pretty cool. Maybe that'll be our other thumbnail. So that's Avenger, regular non-foil. 
there's the uh, upside down exec oh that's executor capital it's a capital superclass star destroyer um houndstooth ig 2000 mist hunter punishing one tie avenger tie bomber and then some weapons four loms concussion rifle boss mortar gun dengar's blaster ig88 neutral inhibitor IG-88 Pulse Cannon, Proton Bombs, Zook Snare Rifle, and some effects. Let's do, let's do TIE Bomber next to the Avengers. There's the Avenger, Foil, TIE Bomber. Um, let's see, Bad Feeling I Have, Have I, is another Yoda card. Broken Concentration, Corrosive Damage, Failure at the cave, field promotion, flagship. He's not ready, I want that ship. Knowledge and of defense. Location, 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 lost in space. Much anger in him, precision targeting. Rogue asteroid, shot in the dark, sudden impact. Dark path, there is no try. Visage of the emperor, dangerous time. Apology accepted, close call, control. Defense, fire, these are interrupts now. Fear, frustration, hollow net transmission, imbalance. Lando system, rest Luke Ra Auf. Um, shut him up or shut him down. Something hit us, take evasive action. Those rebels won't escape us. Uncertain is the future, unexpected interruption and foyer. So those are all 180 cards in the Dagobah set of Star Trek customizable card game. I'll move these up so you can see them on screen. And um, feel free to subscribe to this channel if you are a fan of Star Wars customizable card games. We're going to go through about eight of the expansion, um, eight sets total. One limited premiere set and then seven expansion sets and take a look at what cards were in those sets and what some of the um, challenges were for set collecting back in the day uh, they don't make these cards anymore they're almost almost 30 years old probably in a couple years i think there's going to be a 30th anniversary for star wars and people are going to want to collect these cards in 2025 so just a quick preview today on this set um, again, subscribe to the channel so you'll get a notification when the next set goes live, probably next week. And I think I'm aiming for Wednesdays, like a Star Wars Wednesday. I don't know. If that's a thing, let me know if, if that works for you. I'll try to hit that every week. Um, but I really appreciate you watching and commenting below, um, especially if you're a Magic collector or MetaZoo or Flesh and Blood player and want to get into other card games either to play them or to just study them or even to collect them so let this video be a resource for you i appreciate you watching and uh, may the force be with you